the, the, the according makeup to Dyson, is definitely of the devil. Makeup is of the devil. The That's Bible it. says makeup is of the devil, MD. Which scripture? The Bible says that the devil may come to you as any shape or any form or as anything. And that's just what y'all girls is doing makeup. We always come as like it's any just shape, any form. Lights and shadows. That's the devil. They say the devil lurks in the shadows. Oh god. Mm -hmm. And they even is called that stuff which always be a shadow. Eye shadow. It's the devil. Hi Daddy, what you doing? Genius sniper, HG boy, <laughs> master <laughs> producer. What you know about it? <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first episode of A Couple of Views. We're entertainers in the Bahamas, so everything is gonna be from our point of view. Just our opinions, you know. Nobody should catch feelings. Don't catch feelings, because we didn't do that. I'm probably going to be the person that's the most politically correct. This guy. Wendy and I have different. Wendy, Wendy please, and I don't understand why there's still an argument about what is Bahamian music. I feel as though Bahamian music is breaking straight from Junkanoo. I feel like Bahamian music is any music made by a Bahamian. And we say what is Bahamian music, we're not talking about the artist. The but artist what, may be Bahamian. But what but is mu Bahamian is music? music Bahamian any music, music is music indigenous right. to the Bahamas. What is a Bahamian doctor? A doctor that is Bahamian. Yes. What is Bahamian music? But, but music no, what is Bahamian made? medicine? That's that's the medicine, right analogy. That's medicine, the parallel. Medicine created by a Bahamian. Because art is an expression of self. Okay? There's no art that can be created without a person doing it. Yeah. Right? So Bahamian right. medicine is, even though it's medicine, probably like formulated by a person, is already in the ground. It's already Bahamian. So I, I get that you're saying that a non-Bahamian can create Bahamian medicine. But medicine is something that's already created by the by the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. And why are you looking at me like that? I ain't looking at you, I was looking at the camera. Art can only be created by a person. Yes. And if the person is But how is that person inspired? Is the person inspired by a music that is born someplace else? Music is a universal language. Yeah. I do not think that music should be subjugated to ethnicities or regions or ge geographical whatever. We have Bahamian pop, we have Bahamian R&B, and that's how I No, I don't feel that way. I didn't even hear a word she said. Brings us to our next topic. Let's just move on. Our next topic is culture. Wait, who wins? Who wins? Culture. Is it a draw? No, we'll let them decide. How do you feel about the existing stance of Bahamian culture? I think it's fabulous. We just have to believe in ourselves, but we have to be confident and go and do what we need to do. And we exactly. have to learn how to support one another because we seem to have a big problem with that. Bahamians need to support. Culture is the way of the people. However, the, the people are forced to live based on their environment, based on what they have to do in order to make life sustainable is their culture. Our music culturally is based on what we have readily available to us to make Which music. Which would mean our current culture is not breaking straight. It would mean that our current culture no, 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 no. is no, 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 no. It became our culture. It became our culture because that is what we adopted to. I'm gonna pull to I'm gonna go to the available. The arts and other manifestations of human intellectual achievements regarded collectively. A second definition says it is a cult wait, the cultivation of bacteria, tissue cells, etc. Exactly. That's not exactly. That means you're wrong. That's not the meaning of That means she's wrong. There's too many. There's far too many big words in that definition. Culture and heritage are two different things. Culture is now. Culture is now. It's right only. now. So we do agree on that. All right. Look at that, God. Look at that. It's something that we should talk about. A lot of our music that we perform now, that we call indigenous Ricky Stray music, a lot of it is not original material. And country song. It's country music. That we put Remix. to our rake and spray Remix. beat, but it's not, it's not original material. So would you then say that's Bahamian music? I wouldn't. I it did is, not. It is, how it can is you a Bahamian name a cover? The lyrics is just the explanation of the song. Just, you can't say just when you're talking about the lyrics. The lyrics is the lyrics. The lyrics is the, and melody is just as important. Who's right and who's as, wrong. As we had on a couple of views, and we do have the Ministry of Youth, Sports, and Culture. Minister Danny Johnson is here to speak. What is Bahamian music? He should be music? able to just squash Dyson and I's debate. He should be able to do <laughs> well, that. What, first, what's the debate? What is Bahamian music? Is she it music says, made by a Bahamian? 
Or is it breaking through the junk? No, I say that it is any music made by a Bahamian. And that, uh, no, 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 no. And that you should you should refer to music by genre. You should say break and scrape is a genre. Bahamian junk and music is a genre. On the surface, I'm saying it, it music by if you're gonna say what is Bahamian music, you're talking about the birthplace of the sound. Yeah. And I think that's and limiting structure. music to geography, nationality, and ethnicity. Question. But they're two different questions. So seeing that I'm sitting in the middle. Yeah. Clear I it think up. I think break and scrape is our national music. Junkanoo is the national festival. Okay. Bahamian culture is what we are, how we do it, where we're from, where, how we speak. So it is, you know, the beauty of what we have been possessed with, okay. that we've inherited. We didn't do this. Okay. And then what we built, this thing that we face here, Fort, that's Fort Charlotte, over there is Fort Darcy. Did we learn things on a couple of years? Hello. So this was here before we came. Or you and I came. So would you call that heritage or culture? That's heritage, right? right? So that's heritage. Yeah. But the heritage determines your cultural space. Now every generation pushes the envelope further. So when when my parents voice heard Bob Mali, they were like, the devil is coming. <laughs> but when my brother heard Bob Mali, they said, you know, you know, the black your hero has arrived. Yeah. So now I hear Russians singing him, singing Mali, Canadians. Okay, let me that is now. When you hear a Russian singing Mali, do you not call that reggae or do you call that Jamaican music? Reggae. You call it ah, ah. However, it's reggae, but what they only, knows? but they know that's from Jamaica. Absolutely. And so we want to make sure that when people hear Dyson, yes. When they hear Ronnie no. Butler. When they hear you KB, when, when they hear D Mark, that they'll say, and when you hear Wendy, you'll know that this is this music of the genre, yeah. however played by a Bahamian. Yeah. Now okay. we now we need to, to evolve to an identifiable sound, okay. and our culture is so complex and deep that I think we haven't fused together yet the sound. The you know, reggae started out as this very simple style. Ah, exactly. And Chris Blackwell was not a Jamaican. Chris Blackwell here in Nassau, at Compass Point, that man took reggae and changed it from tank to tank and tank and tank tank to tank. Wake up, stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up. So we're at that same stage now. You all are going to produce the Bahamian sound. I will put it to you yet. The Bahamian sound has not yet been produced. I would and I would put to you what Marcus Garvey said in Nassau. It says, the Bahamas will always be the last to come to the table because we're conservatives. It says, but when they come, they can bring it. Oh. And, they have, and they always have the potential oh. to be the very best. That is epic. So when I close up, what I'm talking about is Bahamian culture. It is a place, a space of people who really desire as people who came here as slaves and indentured servants and were rejected by the world that we couldn't do this, that we, our culture, will be a group of little people who desire to be the very, very best. We the new world people. You all got the technology in your hands. Literally. You got the truth. You got the tradition. You got the technology. Man. Talent. And I a talent love man knocking out the park. True technology, tradition, tradition and, and talent. talent. You heard it here first on just a couple of views. So, right from the word to the mouth. That's it. This is a couple of views with Wendy and Dyson Knight. Sound like, sound like they're a couple. I understand my side of the view. And we want y'all to decide for yourself. Make your comment below and like and share. So guys, that was our very first episode of Just a Couple of Views. We had, you spoke with Italia? I spoke with Italia. Oh, I didn't